Mitchell, here we go! Rotak immediately comes forward, and TJ's on his bike. Early, he closes up with Rotak, throws the knees. Rotak outside low kick. Front kick from TJ, body shot from Rotak. Big left hook from Rotak. TJ moving, throws a high left. Inside thigh kick from Rotak. Overhead right from DJ and Cracker, abusing. Elbows from Rod Tang in the clinch, and knee from DJ. Rod Tang with a hook. The crowd loving it, the action. Round kick off the left leg from DJ. On the outside, Rod Tang, body shot, inside thigh kick to the back leg. High check there from DJ. He's circling into the power side of Rod Tang. Now goes the opposite way. Overhand right from TJ. Rodzak staying close. Body shot again from the tie. Fake there from Rodzak. TJ forced to cover up. There's an elbow. There's a knee from Rodzak. One minute 49 remaining in the Muay Thai round. You can see DJ's having a little bit of difficulty with the Muay Thai rule set. He keeps clenching and trying to look for a tie up. But Rodzak is doing a great job of pressuring him into that. Rotak almost threw him into Olivia Cost. Inside thigh kick from Rotak. Front kick to a round kick from TJ. Nice combination. Under 90 seconds remaining in the Muay Thai round. Can Rotak get him out of there? TJ lands a good hook. Overhand elbow from Rotak. Rotak definitely senses the urgency in these first three minutes. He's coming out banging. Do you know DJ wants to get that clinch again, get that tie up, and drag him down to the ground? It's only three minutes now. It's not the usual five minutes that TJ is used to. Montag's got good movement on the back foot. Circling the cage really well, not allowing DJ to pin him up against the wall. Can Montag get it into a third round where it shifts back to Muay Thai rules? DJ taking his time, does not want to make a silly mistake. He knows he has to maximize time because he doesn't just have to fight Rotang in this round. He's got to fight the clock in this round. He's got to utilize the time very carefully. And if he shoots one shot, he has to make it count. Two minutes, ten remaining in the second round. And he has first take out attack from Tindra. Over the top of the ground. He's got the back of Rotang. He's got the back of Rotang. They're dry, Michael. They're not that sweaty yet. This is a bad spot for Rotang. Rod Tang should use the wall as a defensive mechanism to try to keep DJ from fully taking his back. Rod Tang carrying the weight of DJ, posting up on that right arm. The tie defending as DJ's gonna try and soften him up, trying to look for the choke, look to strangle it. A bad spot for Rod Tang with 135 remaining. Rod Tang defending. Rod Tang's never been in this position, never. His life with a 12 time world champion on his back trying to choke him out. Good defense there, how he had using his arm to prevent the hand from sliding out there. You can see DJ's trying to pull the hand. There this he goes. It. Now it's under the neck. This is it. Rotten's right. gotta relax. He could panic tap. Right. Can he hold on? Oh, he put the hand at the top. That's great defense. DJ's gonna transition. He goes back to it. Rotten's gotta continue to fight that top hand. You know, Rotten! Is it gonna tap? No, 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 it's a slip! It's a slip! It's a hole! It's good night, Irene! To make sure his Johnson puts him on tank to sleep! The Iron Man. Mighty Mouse is victorious. Have a look at this. As Mitch said, he was waiting for the right time. One attempt at a takedown. Got the back of Rotten. The beginning of the end starts here and ends here. Montag survived as long as he could. And you know what? He didn't tap out. He did not tap out. He went to sleep. Let's go to Tom Lau, make the official. You kicked me out from one day, you kicked me that hard, yeah? has called a stop to this contest after two minutes and 13 seconds in the second round. For your winner, by way of rear naked choke, Demetrius Johnson!